Hi, it's me again with Corel Raw Tips and Tricks. Somebody sent me this file, and one, I'm blown away by the artistic ability of this person to draw this. Uh, I would really be interested to learn how to do that. But anyway, he's using an artistic media tool, and he's actually using one called the expression. And it's use pressure and tilt and bearing of your stylus. So it's really made for a, a, a tablet. But right here, it's hard to tell if it's on or off. If it's grayed out right now. So it's off, I'm thinking. So we're gonna draw a line, draw a line. And we're drawing a half inch line, if you notice. I'm gonna click off of it and grab the brush again. And this time I'm gonna turn it on. And I'm gonna draw a line and another line. So let's look at this. If I take this line using the parallel dimension tool, well, I didn't measure very good. Let me back up here. Let me zoom in here. Let's take the parallel dimension tool and let's measure this line. They're a half inch, but let's do this. Let's in, take them all and enlarge them 100%, make it 200% bigger. Now the, this line is still, well, it says it's one inch because it's trying to do that, but this line is still a half of an inch. Where this line is one inch, or they're about, depending on where you measure it from. So I think he knows that, so I don't 100% understand the question, but I thought I'd go and do a video to kind of show you that, because when you're drawing a line, just a regular line, you can go down here and change it and scale with object in here. The artistic media tool is a little different. This is, shows up as not a line. There is a line inside there. You can see it when you're moving it. So if you go to object, break artistic media apart, there is a line in there. It's hidden. There it is right there, and we can right click and make it black. But there, I don't know way to set it. So really this line is a fill. And it, it's, it's working off the scale with object. So maybe he'll get back to me and we'll figure out more what he's talking about. I don't know if there's a way to set it at default where everything is the same width all the time. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.